All right, everybody, welcome back to some more Pixelmon Adventures. It is I, Zell, starting today. Uh, I did do the changes that I needed to do uh, last time. I also sorted out and emptied out my inventory, so we no longer need to worry about uh, inventory uh, as much anymore. Uh, I'm just going to store the Pokeballs in here so we have an inventory in here. Uh, last time, we were trying to beat some gyms, and none of that was working. So we need to go find easier gyms that we can actually take down uh the other thing as well that we need to start uh trying to do while i have lag for some odd reason uh give me a second while i go look that up is there a reason why i'm getting lag here nope minecraft is needed okay well i'll close this i'm not going to be uploading today have that load oh yeah because that's on the other thing yeah i don't need this loaded up anymore i don't need that anymore all right let's hope that that actually does uh help out at least a little bit uh so this time uh i did fix uh the oddity uh the difference that i did is that i grabbed from the single player world that i used to have or that i used to play on and I ended up moving it from there, which unfortunately meant that I had to delete the older version. It's really loud for me. Grottle, come on, man. That was weird. I don't know why he allowed me to skip Nan. Uh, so, so this isn't the exact one that I brought in, but this is actually what it was supposed to look like. And unfortunately, we can't get there because we don't have a Flymon, and I really... Unless we can fly on Gligar, I doubt it, though. Yeah, we can't fly on Gligar. So, like, until we get the... What's it called? The, um... Until we get the Trap Inch to be a Flygon, we're gonna be stuck over here. Uh, ignore one of these waypoints. I'm not quite sure where exactly it is. Ah, that one right over there. Ignore this one. This one is supposed to be when we get a total of 16 badges. So ignore that one for now. Uh, th again, that one's only for 16 badges. I need to make sure that it's all fixed and prepped and ready to go. So I brought it into the world just so I could go do that whenever I have some free time in order to go and do that. I actually did do a lot of the maintenance that I needed to do for that one manually, except for there was one thing that I don't know exactly how to do it. I don't even know exactly how it happened the first time. Maybe I ended up cheating it in a way that I don't know how I did it beforehand, but eh, I'll show you what it is uh, whenever we get a hold of uh, a Flygon, pretty much. Uh, but right, oh, right, another thing that I did is I moved this banner over here instead of over there. Uh, I thought it would look really nice, and it kind of is. I hate that, like, when you get too close to it, it kind of just disappears. That's the only thing I don't like about it. Anyway, I'm still sick, feeling a lot better, though, so at least, like, I won't be coughing as much, though. I'm gonna try and do my best to actually not cough as much. But, yeah. Anyway, let's go to where we were last time. I forget exactly where it is, but let's just go to a random area and hope that we actually get close to a gym that we can actually go and do. We did a water gym. Okay, so it's this one then. So we got so we went to this one. We tried to do this one and then everybody just seems to have too many high level Pokemon. Or they have fully evolved Pokemon like Empoleon at level like 16 or something like that. So we can't really do anything about that, unfortunately. And I don't think we can travel nearly as much as I would like. Because again, we don't have a flyer. And uh, not only do we not have a flyer, but we also do not have a transfer tutor. Oh. Oh, 
Ah, okay. I was a bit confused by what it was asking. Oh, he has a set list. I thought he's like, transfer your Pokemon and I'll go give you a move. I was like, uh, no. No, thank you. So if you didn't watch the last session, uh, we ended up changing our type. So instead of using dark because we finished eight gyms, we are now using ground types. And our biggest uh, heavy uh, sort of burden right now is that uh, I forgot exactly uh, if ground type even has any flyers. Until I remembered that you should be able to ride on a flygon. So, uh, yeah. Traffic. I should be able to take on traffic. Alrighty then. Uh, Giga Drain then. Let's get some health for that. Yes. Trap Inch is growing. Drop off. No. We don't really need sand. So I'm still currently working on something for 1.21. Uh, I am currently awaiting news that 1.20 has been released. That's where my fingers are crossed at right now. Ooh, Nummel. Good job, Nummel. Let's head over there. Please don't tell me you have Sturdy. Thank you. That'll give us more HP. Why not? Eh, sure, why not? We'll take the point. Throttle! Our first ever shiny, too. Well, at least the first ever shiny that I didn't actually kill. Which I actually have a do good, uh, which I do have a good reason why I keep killing all the shinies. There's actually no reason for us to have shinies in here. I mean, if you can somehow transfer a Pixelmon shiny to the main games, I'd be like, hey, that'd be awesome. I'd be catching all the shinies I get a hold of, but there is none. Trimmage. Mine. Take the sand this time. Ooh, level 35. Please don't take me out of one shot, please. Ooh, I did decent damage. Did I miss? On. Yes. That should be helpful. Okay, I'll take all. Can you stop giving me random sands and stop putting it on my hotbar? I understand that I left my hotbar open. Those are for more useful items. I don't have any giga rings anymore. Go away. Game. Thank you. Yeah, I think both Cube and my computer actually have to restart. <laughs> that will have to be after I record the thing I want to do after, because I definitely need more videos of that. So, uh, like, I've been trying to make sure that the fan game that we've been uh, that I want to do next because I've been seeing videos about it and it looks very interesting. I've been trying to see if it would actually be very interesting for me to play. Uh, because if you did not know, if I don't like it, uh, I won't play it kind of thing. 
So it's almost like res respect like my opinion on that, please, because like if I don't like playing it, I don't want to play it. And so far, I actually do like playing it. Uh, but when I do it for the channel, uh, because for s some reason, it actually has a um, it actually has a uh, what do you call it? It has a dang it, man! I had it in my head. Uh, it has a new game plus, which means that you can keep all the Pokemon from your other like sort of series kind of thing. Uh, the only thing is that, like, I will definitely use it. Uh, I have seen what happens when you use it. So, it's not going to be, like... So, it's not like it's going to catch me off guard or anything like that. It's just that I don't... The save that I currently use that I just turned into New Game Plus is not really exactly how I would want it. So, I'm going to go back on it and continue playing it. I did back it up just in case it would revert the save back into like restarting the game over again. So it does give me the option to skip the intro. The only thing that I am not 100% certain of is that if you, because it gives you the ability to change your player's name. If that also means that it changes how the original trainer data works as well. Because I don't know how the original trainer data itself is. I don't want to say I don't want to say stored, but I also don't know like if it's more so like compared to. Like if it's more so compared to uh, what do you call it? Um, like, if the name doesn't matter, but it's, like, the IDs that matter kind of thing. So, like, if two people have the same IDs, uh, the Pokemon will listen to them as if they're not traded. But it doesn't really matter, because there's also a NPC in the game that allows you to change it. It's much later on in the game. And it has a very, very high cost. For it to use that service, it's like I think like thirty thousand or something like that. No, sorry, fifty thousand. My bad. What level are you? You're level forty three. I'm going to avoid you. Ah. Uh. So yeah, so I'm just trying to do as much uh, of my re uh, as much research as I can. I already found out that I screwed something up, so I'm trying to uh, fix that. But it's not gonna happen. Uh, also, when it goes uh, when the when you click New Game Plus, it's not like oh you get to keep all your level 100s and stuff like that. That's not what happens. What actually happens is that all your Pokemon uh, revert down to level five. So they're back to like a playthrough like level, which is actually very good. The only thing I don't know is if you actually retain any of the items. I didn't check that far. I just checked to see what the, how the Pokemon would look. Because the Pokemon that I've been using, I would have laughed if it kept them at their fully evolved forms, but just reverted them down to level five. I also don't know if the Pokemon actually retained their EV values. Because I fully EV trained my team. So, yeah. If they keep their EVs, we're good to go. Because they, it's actually very good. Mind you, I haven't really done much testing with the EV since I recently did change them. Since I found out you can actually get the EV reducing berries. So I was able to have fun with that. Actually, that flower that I just saw, does it produce slowness to the player? Because that would be very interesting. Hello, Swinub. 
Bergmite. I'm going to avoid you for now. Nothing. Okay, that's interesting. Okay. Can't see another one of those flowers. Holy cow. I want to know if it actually provides slowness. <gasps> Rowlet! Oh, you're one of my favorite starters. It doesn't even have to be Hisuian. It just has to be an, uh, like a relic, and it's awesome. Oh, well, here we are. And he would be my friend. And I would be very happy. I don't know. I liked playing Sun and Moon with just uh, using the... Um, using just a Sedui. It was awesome. Just to sit there and just use it was amazing. I want to try this. I don't think it's going to work. Giga Drain. Oh, of course it has Sturdy. Why am I not surprised that it has Sturdy? There you go. Bye-bye.